All right, we're doing this. And he high. Okay, we. This is for head bolt torque. Okay, the torque of the head bolts that nobody can find apparently or put on YouTube. All right, head gasket first. I'm gonna show y'all a few things. Okay, the head gasket. I removed these grommets. Okay, these little tiny copper grommets. I removed them. Put electrical tape back in place just so it'd stay on there and not fall off on me. Okay, everything still lines up. Been doing this for a while. Ain't no issues with it. But you don't want to leave in those grommets because it bends the head gasket and can cause problems later. Another thing you want to do, you want to take a little bit of oil, put on the inside, okay? Just run it around the inside. You want to make sure your head bolts are clean, okay? Put a little dab of oil on the end so it runs in better. Now, that will definitely get you set right. Also, you want to take each one of the head bolt holes, okay? You want to spray brake cleaner in there, air it out, and you, it works a lot better than leaving them dirty. The thing I made, I know the place is dirty, is this right here, okay? It's just a valve, hook it up to your air hose, stick it in the hole, okay? Right in the hole, put it all the way to the back and run it up and down after you do the brake cleaner or clean it out real good, okay? Another thing is, the, where is my tool? What a mess. Okay, another thing is, this little handy dandy tool right here, all right, like a little diagrander. Except you buy this little end, put it on there. Okay, get the real fine grit, works great. See how it surfaces the heads? Now this one has been milled down and then I had to bring it back because they didn't do a very good job. Okay, nice and smooth, I just kind of cleaned it up. Also did this over here with it. Okay, let me pull this back off so I can show you. Okay, this is about as clean, there we go, about as clean as this is going to get with this. You don't want to use a wire brush and mess it up, okay? Either way, there you go. Make sure it is clean and there is nothing in the way. Now we're going to do the head bolt tightness. Okay. Another thing I forgot to mention, this is just a speed handle, okay? I just run it in and I snug it with this, okay? Snug it all the way around in your torque sequence. Sweet sequence. Okay, after you get all that snug, all right, with the speed wrench, you're going to take it from one, two, don't matter on the crisscross, three, four, five, six. That's going to be your pattern every time, okay, for right now till we get on up here. We're going to start this at 35 foot-pounds, okay? You want to turn a little bit at a time, and we're going to start at 35. We're going to increase it. 10 pounds every time. So we're going to go 35, 45, 55, 65. 75 is our final torque, okay? For now, I'll tell you the rest here in a minute. Another thing you need to add in, don't reset your torque. Just do this side 35, do the other side 35. It allows this side to kind of cool down. You know, it bolts heat up whenever you keep on running. Well, you want to get a good thing, so take your time with it. Increase it 10 pounds every time till you hit 75, okay? And then what you're going to do, once you're at 75, you're going to take only the middle head bolts, okay? This one and this one, all right? You're gonna take those and you're gonna increase those to 85 foot-pounds, got it? That is your torque specs, okay? That's what you wanna do. 75 all the way around 10 pound increments that means increase at 10 pounds every time starting from 35 after hand tight and not hand let's break this bolt tight just snug it then so you're going to snug them all you're going to go to 35 and then you're going to go from 35 10 pound increments 35 45 55 65 75 stop at 75 do them all in the sequence you got to go one two three four five, six, okay? Do the sequence every time. Jump from side to side. As you're doing that, and you'll just keep on increasing your torque wrench a little bit every time. Okay, then you're going to, after you have 75 all the way around, you're gonna go 85, 85. Now I go ahead and do 75 again, and then do 85 one more time just to make sure. Ain't never had any problems with this. Always a first for something, but that is your torque specs, okay? 75 all the way around, 85 center. All right. Hope y'all enjoyed the crappy video. There you go.